when it comes to fast food chicken, there is Chick-fil-A, Popeyes, KFC. They're like the holy trinity. Below them, there is Cane's probably. Churches is around. Bojangles, Zaxby's. I'd say those are like... And this is in terms of like popularity, might I add. Popularity. So obviously, Popeyes, Chick-fil-A, KFC are the top three. And then it's... Next tier, probably Canes, uh, Bojangles, Zaxby's. Then maybe a tier below that is Churches. Maybe on the same level as Churches, if not a tier below that, there's Jollibee. Jollibee is a Filipino. So yeah, Jollibee is a fast food joint that focuses on chicken they have other stuff other than chicken but they just focus on chicken and they have a uh <sighs> focus on chicken but there's a filipino twist as the website says these they're kind of few and far between i don't know how many locations of Jolly Bee there are but i can't imagine it's that much <sighs> But there is one that's semi nearby. It's like forty minutes away. It's a place. It's on a road I used to go on all the time, but I moved a little further away from it, so I'm not there so much. So now it's about forty minutes away instead of twenty. But with that being said, I am going to Jollibee. When I heard this place was coming to near me, I got stoked because, uh, shout out Keith Habersberger. I think he didn't eat the menu on this place, and I remember it being pretty pretty positive. When looking at their menu, they've got chicken, burgers, spaghetti, and then they, there's one more thing called the Palabrook Fiesta, or something like that, which is like a Filipino noodle dish. It's on their, like, obviously their main website, but when I go to order it from the Sterling Heights location specifically, uh, I don't see that anywhere, so I don't know what's going on with that. Um, probably not available at that location if I had to guess. A little butt hurt, but with that being said, I uh, still plan on getting as, as a smorgasbord of food at this Jollibee. I got a one-piece chicken joy with spaghetti, original chicken sandwich, spicy deluxe sandwich, big yum burger combo because they do burgers too, two-piece burger steak with mashed potatoes, and uh, it's like burger steak looks like. Kind of like Salisbury steak, I guess. I don't know. It's like burger patties with like sauce and looks like mushrooms on them. And then a peach mango pie and then a pineapple refresher type thing. They got like some special pineapple drink. Um, so I'm going to be getting a lot of things. Maybe get, uh, what are their other sides? Let me look at their other sides real quick. So yeah, their sides are just rice. They got a side order of the spaghetti, but I'm getting that with the chicken. And then it's just the peach mango pie, which I'm getting. And then it's just rice, pretty much, with mashed potatoes and gravy. So, yeah, the, pretty much the only thing I'm not going to be getting is the rice, which I can do without. Because um, I'm getting fries in the combo. If they got that Palo Brook Fiesta thing there, and I don't know about it, and it's just not coming up, I'm just going to get it. But other than that, that's what it is. It's the night before I'm going. It's like 1 a.m. Uh, Tyler's meeting me there. I'm going to see Monkey Man before that. I'm excited for this, to get this Jollibee. I hear it's damn solid. I'm excited. I will see you tomorrow afternoon. Technically this afternoon, because it's the morning of when I'm going. But I'm going there. I'll see you when I get there. I'm going to bed. I'm really tired. But you get all the benefits of editing and post-production. So I'll see you in a few seconds. So I'm here at Jolly Bee. Oh shit, that's really peaking. Um, I hold it really far away. I'm here at Jolly Bee. Uh, Tyler's here. He's not on camera, but he's got a mic. I'm here. Hold it a little I'm further. Here. I'm, he I'm here, brother. Yeah. What's up, brother? What's up, brother? Uh, but I got a smorgasbord. I got a one-piece chicken joy with spaghetti. Uh, a 
jolly spaghetti. I'm, can, can you even like read this? Small chicken joy gravy. A chicken sandwich, a spicy chicken sandwich. A cheesy yum burger, I wanted the big yum, but they didn't have it. I got a two piece burger steak with mashed potatoes. Um, and then a peach mango pie, I wanted tenders too, but they didn't have that. I don't see, I thought I got fucking a combo of fries. I might, I might just have to snack some of your fries. That's okay. Um, yeah, we're waiting for the food. I got a lot, so we're just waiting. So I got everything. I literally have two full bags of food. Um, this is like some pineapple mango quencher thing they have. So I made sure to get that as a drink. Oh, I opened it up, but I didn't want to drink it off camera. So let's, let's take a sip. Oh, he loves it. <laughs> he loves well, it. Well, it's pineapple, and I love pineapple. So that's really good. That gets a pass. But I'm just gonna start pulling shit out and eating it. What do we got here? Mashed potatoes. Oh my god. So much food. Give, did you give them a wide shot of everything? That's a good idea. <laughs> Look at his. Look at Tyler's puny little tray. <laughs> okay, so I got the mashed potatoes. So no leftovers. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not, I ain't looking to I ain't looking to die at a Jolly Bee. These potatoes look weird. They're like so not smooth. What? They look very rigid for potatoes. <laughs> Steaming. Burger salad. I got a burger too, so you'll hear it from the expert. Um, mashed potatoes are solid. I mean, they're just they're mashed potatoes. I think mashed potatoes, and I like them, but I think in general they're overrated. People like lose their shit for them, and I don't get it. I like mashed potatoes, but I mean, I don't feel like a fast food place. Well, I like them, but some people will be like, dog mashed potatoes. <laughs> Are you going to finish those? Are you going to eat those potatoes, brother? I'm, set, I'm setting, yeah. Give me those mashed potatoes, brother. <laughs> brother. I'm setting the peach mango pie aside, because that's dessert. Let's crack this open. What is? What do we got here? What do we got here? Oh, God. So I think one of the most interesting things is that they serve fucking spaghetti here. They also have that Palo Bach Fiesta thing on the website, but they don't serve it at this location, I guess. A little butt hurt, but this is the only Jollibee for, I think, in Michigan. So what's, what's in that? It's like a Filipino dish. Because oh, okay. it's like chicken with a Filipino theme is the whole thing here. Interesting. But let's try this chicken. It is crumbling in my hands. <laughs> Completely fall off the bone. It's falling off the bone. Chicken. It's good. I've had more flavorful chicken, but this might be like the crispiest I've had. Better than KFC? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Would I like... At least I think. I don't think that highly of KFC. It's okay. That's what I'm it's saying. It's like kind of mid, honestly. Would I rather have... Canes with cane sauce, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But for fast chicken, that's solid. I'd probably rather have that than like a Chick fil A tender. Oh, okay. Alright, well, let's try this fucking spaghetti dog. This is just so crazy to me. This is crazy. Bring back mixed spaghetti. The spaghetti. Oh, it's like, like there's like hot dog in here. I didn't even know that. Sheldon Cooper? Sheldon Cooper reference? Is it in spaghetti? Yeah. I thought he liked hot dogs and spaghetti. He liked hot dogs and something. I thought it was like mac and cheese. No, I thought it was spaghetti. <laughs> Maybe you could be right. <laughs> Shout out Sheldon. On um, the spaghetti, it's, it's all right. I mean, it's fast food spaghetti. So I feel like your minds can't, your expectations can't be that high. If you have a spaghetti, hankering probably make it at home because it's a very simple thing to make <laughs> and it's cheap but if you really just aren't in the mood to cook this will definitely like curb it but would I get it again maybe on select days but I'd like to see what else they got yeah a little bit of a miss on the spaghetti a little bit
Now what we got here? The end of bag one. This looks like a chicken sandwich, or at least one hand. Probably because it's, oh, this is the spicy. Ooh. Look at that bun glistening on there. That is a that very is shiny a bun. bun. I, this is the spicy sandwich. I got an original one as well. This one I think I wanted deluxe, but it's okay. <laughs> I did say deluxe. <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. They're busy, brother. It's okay. I mean, this place has been here for what? A few months now at this point. I specifically waited so it wouldn't be busy, and this it's still like busy. This is the first time I haven't seen like a line out the drive through <laughs> I know. I was going back and forth on Hall Road all day today looking at how busy it is doing my errand running. So I went to Krispy Kreme. They didn't have the donuts. Then I went to my movie at Partridge Creek. Then went back to Krispy Kreme. And now I'm here. <laughs> Tuesday, Tuesday. Let's try the spicy sandwich. How is it? It's good. Just good? Yeah. It's not like a really it's not good like, It's not like Popeyes or anything okay. like that. A little bit, yeah. Disgusting. I think I'm gonna save the chicken sandwich and pop it off the bird. You absolutely disgust me. I'm sorry. <laughs> so the spicy sandwich, the chicken's really not all that warm. Really? It's like, it's definitely not cold, but I wouldn't call it like, like it's not like the freaking chicken leg that I had that was like fresh <laughs> out of the fryer. Like this patty's definitely been sitting, and it's really not all that spicy. Um, I'd say the spiciest thing is the jalapenos on it, and even that, it's like, I've got such a tolerance at this point that jalapenos don't really do much for me. It tastes good though, but would I get it again? Maybe I'm not coming back to Jollibee. Maybe this is a one and done. Maybe, I mean, it's 40 minutes away from me, so it might be it's that regardless for me. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of why I want to get absolutely everything. Okay, I got some of Tyler's fries here. The french fries. Where would, where would they fall on a tier list? Right. I can tell you right now, these are way colder than anything I had that day. <laughs> that was like an anomaly for you. Yeah, I, I, that was the most wild, that was the biggest standout of that video for me, was just how fucking hot every fry was. <laughs> right. They're good fries. Yeah, they're fine. I actually kind of like them. Like, if they're hot, I'd give them like an A tier. Really? Yeah, I like those fries a lot. All right, let's try this burger. Now, I did want the big Aloha burger, or whatever it is, the big yum burger with like the lettuce and the tomato on it. They didn't have that, so I got one down. That's quite small. This is a small burger. Ooh, covered in sauce. Drippy in sauce. This one is just like sauce, cheese, meat, and bun. First off, what do you think of the burger? It was like a, it was a solid, it was a fine burger. Um, I probably would prefer other fast food burgers to it, though. Honestly, that's what I was thinking. I'd probably still rather have like a, a quarter pounder over this. Quarter pound, really? Yes. I mean, on size alone, I get that. Um, yeah, I'd, I definitely would rather have like maybe not a quarter pounder, but like a Big Mac or a Whopper. I would rather take. Yeah. It was, it was a fine burger. I maintain the Whoppers like. It's an A-tier burger. It's very it, good. It, yeah, it is like one of the best fast food burgers slept out Slept-on burger. Very slept-on. Yeah. Burger King as a whole is slept-on, if you ask me. It is. I would rather go to their Mc the McDonald's. I agree. I agree. But, so the burger, another mid-tier. Man, Jollibee's looking just mid across Jollibee? the board. Mid-bees? Yeah, mid Jolly mid? <laughs> Let's try this normal chicken sandwich here. That is substantially larger than the spicy chicken one you had. Yeah. Like, substantially. Jesus. This might be the most chicken I've ever seen on a chicken sandwich. In fact, I don't think there's no mite. It's like, <laughs> it's literally like, 
150% the size of the bottom. 95% chicken out here. Yeah. Like, you could borderline just cut off what's hanging off the side and have, like, almost a whole nother sandwich. <laughs> so I'm going to bite from this side, though. Hmm. Already way hotter. Much more fresh. Did you say how you felt about the chicken sandwich? I said it was solid, but definitely not like close to like Popeyes or anything like that. I'd agree that. with that. Popeyes still easily the king. Where I'd rather have it? a Chick Fil A one chicken sandwich, honestly, over this as well. I probably would as well. Yeah. <laughs> Who else has a mean chicken sandwich? Hey, you're the food guy. <laughs> I guess that's fair. <laughs> um, I don't know. Actually, McDonald's kind of has like one that, one that goes like way harder than it should. Right. For McDonald's. Yeah. Which I. Th- I almost want to say I'd rather have that one too. <laughs> this is this is this is disappointing. It, it's fine. It's just I mean, I, I got two you things got, you left got a few, here. A few things to bring it back. Let's see if yeah. it uh, let's see if it holds up. So yeah. All right, onto the, onto the burger stick. This is how Numer's gonna feel about raising canes. I already know. Oh, <laughs> but we gotta go. As I've said countless times on the channel, everything is worth trying, especially canes. <laughs> I got the burger steak and the pie. Okay. So this burger steak, it's like two beef patties with like gravy on it. I think they locked it down like Fort Knox. Yeah, there we go. Oh. It's like two burgers, gravy, and looks like some shrooms. I think I still got my fork. It doesn't look very appealing from uh, the first no, glance. No, it doesn't. <laughs> I mean, it, it's burger patties with yeah. gravy. I, I can't say it looked appealing on the website either, but. <laughs> Nonetheless, we're here. We got it. Down the hatch. We get, fuck. We get a mushroom in there. There we go. So, the burger steak. So far, the weakest thing. It almost tastes like almost sour to an extent. Everything else has been mid, and I would say is like kind of worth getting if you're here. I would say actually avoid the burger steak. Oh no. <laughs> it is not oh, not very good. And I don't hate it and I'll definitely still eat it all, but like everything else I would at least consider ordering again. Burger steak I'd, I'll pass on every time. <laughs> and now last but not least my dessert, the peach mango pie. Two of my favorite things. This kind of looks like a McDonald's pie. That's the first thing I thought. <laughs> Don't mind me. It was like uh, the, the meme of Andy Reid holding the burger. What? <laughs> the meme of Andy Reid holding the burger. Really good, yeah. <laughs> so that wasn't bad. Kind of bland. But it definitely still tastes like... As it, I taste more peach than anything. Really don't know where the mango comes into play. <laughs> but that is everything I got. Chocolate me as a whole, I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty fucking mid. Overrated as fuck. Yeah, in my opinion. I, this one like I thought this place was like I've heard these this place like hyped. I mean, just by every time I come down Hall Road, the line outside mm-hmm. of this place, yeah. insane. And after having it, I would never ever ever wait in a line. Ever. <laughs> like if we were on Hall Road and someone and like you guys wanted to come here, fine. But like, I will never, I will never be like driving all the way out here. I'll never be the one to, you know, be like, yeah. hey, let's go to Jolly Bees. Exactly. I would never just be like, hey, I'd rather yeah. go to Super Chicks if I'm getting like yes. chicken. Super yes. Chicks. That's a, no, that's a chicken place right nearby. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> Where else? I'd almost rather go to like, like Taco Bell or something. <laughs> I like Taco Bell. Though. Yeah, Taco Bell is good. But like. This is definitely like in the realm of fast food, very like mid tier. Yeah, very, a little below. Yeah, very much so. Very much so. Disappointing. Yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna lie. I'm like severely disappointed. <laughs> but hey, that's the way it goes sometimes. 
It's the heart of the cards. You know what it is? It was worth trying. Yes. <laughs> so that's all I got. Ladies and gentlemen, if you've been to Jollibee, please let me know. And am I doing, are we doing something wrong? Is this location bad? Are we, are we gonna get cooked in the comments? You won't, because you're just a guest. I'm the one that's getting I, cooked. I just work here, guys. Yeah, I'm the one that's gonna get cooked. <laughs> but very, very disappointing. But, it's a, and on that note. And on that note. Back to the studio, no. Thanks for watching. <laughs> yeah. And on that note, it's over. Thanks for watching. Like the video if you think you liked it. Might might have the Jolly Bee fan club come behead me. Have some, yeah, we're gonna have some Jolly Bees come after us. <laughs> yeah, if you are a Jolly Bee, sound off in the comments. Let me know what you think. Um, subscribe so you don't miss anything. Big things happening. Just got a new camera bag. Yeah. Make make things a little more portable. Yeah. Yeah. Um. You don't want to miss any videos. <laughs> Food or video game. I try yeah. to say that every time. In case someone's new, they don't know what I make. This I yeah. make food and video they game. They don't know about the heat. Check out that Pacific Drive video. Yo. One of my personal favorites. I'm so proud of that video. It was a banger. <laughs> Shocker. <laughs> me making bangers? I... Who would have thought? Yeah. <laughs> Not me. Um, like I said, sound off in the comments. If you like Jollibee, hate it, I want to hear other thoughts. Because I've, like I said, we've heard this place hyped. I want to know what the hype is about. Because I'm missing it. But that's it. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you hanging out, and I'll see you in the next one.